right guys, I've gotten so many requests on how to use Uniswap at my personal preference. So if you want to copy me, this is how I do it, okay? So I use Coinbase wallet. All right, so this is Uniswap, right? Uh, you come here, you connect to your wallet. Like I said, you need to download the Coinbase uh, wallet. Cover your phrase, you need to copy it somewhere, keep it safe. Once you get over to your Coinbase wallet, um, there's a settings tab over here. There's wallet link over there. And then you click on wallet link and then it gives you this. And then this, it gives you this option to scan a QR code. And then we get the code over here. I quickly use my camera, then it says linking. And then you're linked uh, to Uniswap. Now you have your Ethereum here. I have 0 0.33 Ethereum. And let's say I want to get uh, this token, for example. Do any token pretty much. Let's say you want to buy a Kishu Inu uh, token. <laughs> you type it in Google and you will find it on Etherscan. They click on that and then there's a contract over here. Then it says copy address. You copy the address and then you go to your Uniswap and you, you can select the token over here. You copy paste it and then it shows you Kishu and then it usually shows you add. I will show you guys how to do that. Um, here's a random one. Um, American Akita, I don't know, just been released a couple of hours ago, only 700 holders. Uh, let's try it out. So this is just a random one, not as I don't know if this coin is going to pop or not. But just for this tutorial sake, we're going to paste it in here. It says Mosquito right here. You want to add with some coins. It says to trade with version two. You click on that. You put the slippage over here to like 4%. I'd put 5% just in case, guys. Um, you can never be too safe. And you want to put a little bit less Ethereum because you need, need a little bit for the mining cost. So I put like 2.9, so like 100 less or something, maybe 2.8 even, uh, just in case. So you can swap it and take it out when you need to as well because you also need gas fees when you take it out. So just, just in case. Uh, and then it says swap anyway, confirm swap. And then it says, and then you press OK, and then you should get, as you can see, a notification from the Coinbase wallet, and it asks you. Uh, it shows the mining fee right now. It's eighty-eight dollars, which is a lot, and I'm actually even going to pay more because I always use Fast. Um, so Fast would be one hundred and fifteen dollars. You click that. Fast is always the best. Otherwise, your money gets stuck, guys, and you need to pay these gas fees anyway. So pay and. And they need to see my ID. Now it's been transmitted. So now it could take a couple of seconds, usually like one minute, and then it is swapped. You can view it on Etherscan, see how it's doing. As you can see, it's bending. Estimated 45 seconds to be completed. So now we just wait for the swap to happen. <clears throat> and it's successful. There we go. So it took 33 seconds, and that's how I like it, guys. I usually always pay the highest gas fees, doesn't matter just to get it as fast as possible. With the coins that I suggest, you will make it back anyway, so the gas fee doesn't matter that much. Traded Ethereum to Iskita or whatever other coin you want. And as we can see right now, uh, if we put it to USDT, well, $1,113 worth of Iskita. And I think it should show it on my wallet as well. So then you can keep track of it as well in your wallet. Another way to do it, is actually if you go, for example, on CoinGecko, you know, that's what I'm most excited about right now. You can also copy the contract over here. So click copy, and then you go back to Uniswap. And as we can see, you know, you paste it there and you get Kishu, you know? So anyways, that is how you do it for Uniswap. I hope this helps. I hope I explained it well, um, but that is how I do it. So anyways, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next video.